Oh, I'm covered in mud. This is awesome. What's up, guys? It's your boy Dylan, aka Dirt Bike Dill. Today is going to be a special type of video. We're out here at Akatia Raceway. Never been out here before, so it's going to be the first time making a video on it. Got the KTM warming up. Cole's getting geared up. He's got his KX450 over here. And yeah, today's gonna be a sweet video, so let's get it started. All right, let's do the first laps of the day. The track is super muddy. Rained a lot last night and actually the past like two nights before. So yeah, track's gonna be prime. Let's get it. They have fast tables right here. This track's gonna be so fun. They have another fat ass table. Another mini one right here to a quick turn. This one might be tough later in the day. Oh, this is the big double right here. I saw that one in the videos. That's gonna be pretty sweet later in the day. I drifted that corner, that was fun. Dang, this track is pretty badass, not gonna lie. Oh, I should have went for that one all the way. Oh, same with that one. <laughs> That's funny. Damn, that shit is hella money. <laughs> Can't even tell if I'm in neutral. That's fucking funny. Good job, Dylan. I can't even like feel my handlebars are so muddy. God damn. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. Just slid out on the first lap. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, I'm covered in mud. This is awesome. Yo, it literally just felt like it was straight sliding. It was just wee, wee, wee. My hands are so slippery right now, bro. I like can't even hold onto the bars right now. It's so slippery. God damn. Squirrely gang. All right, let's not slide out right here again. That shit is so slick. <laughs> Son of a bitch, Dylan. Seriously, you're a fucking pussy right now. Seriously, you're a fucking pussy. Can't even fucking ride your bike. Seriously, now. Seriously. Put out twice already. I'm literally just drifting everywhere. This is definitely the muddiest conditions I've ever ridden in. I need to get all these mud off of my gloves because I can't even steer without sliding everywhere. Oh, someone else slid out in the same spot I did, so now I don't feel bad. I need to clean these off. Let's not try to slide out this time. At least I got all the mud cleaned off of my handlebars. Let's get it, boy. Oh my god. Some of these ruts. Alrighty, gnarly as hell. The corner that I slid out in. Almost just drifted out right there again. The dirt is so freaking slick right there. Oh, almost just died right there. Holy shit. Oh my god. I like came up short on that jump and then freaking your suspension bounced all the way into the landing. So glad I didn't go over the bars. No oh, walking to your raceway. You were kicking my ass. There's only been 30 minutes. But still, I hope this changes when you dry up. Because I feel like a freaking noob right now. 
It's cool. This track's definitely got some sick jumps. I just haven't been able to hit anything yet. It's still so muddy and slick. That is what I'm sucking at. Just like this section right here. I'd say that's a good amount of mud I just got off of my bike. Time for round three. Again, I gotta get the first one. I think I gotta hit that other one in fourth. Other guys got it. Oh damn it! That one's fun. Just need to upshift it, that one before it. Get out of the way, don't get out of the way. Oh, what did I just break? Damn, what did I just break? Seriously, Dylan? Seriously? I got coolant coming out everywhere. God damn it. Well, there goes my day. I like came up just a little short on this and then just washed out with the bike. I hate shit kind of hard, but I'm alright. Oh yeah, my radiator fucking... Oh my god. Wow. Oh, dude! I think I know why I washed out. My front tire's flat. Either I had a flat tire and I washed out because of that, or... I popped it on the landing. I really don't know, to be honest with you. Wow. So much for making a good Akatia Raceway video. <laughs> well, time to do the walk of shame back to the truck. Oh, I ripped my pants too. Damn. Man, this vlog is going to cost a little bit. I wish I could keep riding for you guys. We've only been out here for like two hours. Still like three more to go. Alright guys, pull is going to take a lap. 
today's video i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to drop a like comment subscribe down below if you haven't already i'm gonna start diagnosing my problems with the ktm right now honestly i think i can just take off the exhaust and then pop the radiator back in because i'm not able to push it back down into place because the exhaust is bent up so far like look how far back that is bent so it's completely pushed in i think if i take off the pipe i should be good but i'll keep you guys updated in the next video so yeah later